Hi there. Many others like you have asked, how is Satan God of this world? It's intriguing, so let's discuss it, shall we? There's more to discover on gotquestions.org. The phrase God of this world or God of this age indicates that Satan is the major influence on the ideals, opinions, goals, and views of the majority of people. His influence encompasses the world's philosophies, education, and commerce. When people live as if there is no God, they by default follow the God of this world. The unholy thoughts, destructive ideas, wild speculations, and false religions of this world have sprung from Satan's lies and deceptions. Satan is also called the prince of the power of the air and is the ruler of this world. These titles and many more signify Satan's capabilities. He wields a certain amount of authority and power in this world. He is not a king, but a prince, a ruler of some sort. The whole world is under the control of the evil one. This is not to say that Satan rules the world completely. God is still sovereign. Satan is not God with a capital G. He is God with a A small g. God, in his infinite, inscrutable wisdom, has allowed Satan to operate in this world within the boundaries God has set for him. Satan's limits are clearly seen in Job 1 and 2. There, Satan must give an account of himself to God, and it seems he must have God's permission to carry out his plans. At no time can Satan do all he wants, for God restricts his actions. Satan may be the little g God of this world, but his domain is limited to unbelievers. Born-again children of God are no longer under the rule of Satan. God the Father has rescued us from the dominion of darkness and brought us into the kingdom of the Son he loves. The Apostle Paul was sent by God to turn people from the power of Satan to God. Unbelievers, however free they may think they are, are caught in the same snare of the devil and lie in the power of the evil one. As the god of this world, Satan exercises his power over the unbelieving world to keep them spiritually blind to Jesus. The god of this world has blinded the minds of unbelievers so that they cannot see the light of the gospel of the glory of Christ. Satan snatches the gospel from people's hearts, promotes doctrines of demons, and imprisons the lost with his philosophies. As the god of this world, Satan has spread his lies far and wide. Many of his lies have been successful in taking root and deceiving millions. God doesn't exist. God doesn't God care. cannot be trusted. God is evil. Jesus did not you rise can go again to heaven if you're good enough. Do any of these sound familiar? In conclusion, as god of this world, Satan puts forward his agenda, and the unbelievers in this world follow. Thankfully, our Lord is greater than the God of this world, proven every time he cast out a demon. The God of this world is no match for Christ. Jesus came to open eyes that are blind, to free captives from prison, and to release from the dungeon those who sit in darkness. All right, that answers your question. How is Satan God of this world? Thanks for watching.